Hi, it's Jess with Just Makes Sense, and today's haul video unboxing is Bath and Body Works, a order that I placed, I think, the di two days before SAS. On Instagram, you should follow Cups and Candles, and I'll leave their handle in the description box below. They had a contest of 20% off coupons. I was one of the winners. I couldn't let the 20% off coupon go to waste. So I'm blaming them for this haul when my husband yells at me. So thank you very much, ladies. But seriously, go follow them on Instagram. I'll leave their handle. They do the candles, all the Bath and Body Works stuffs, but they also do the Starbucks cups. And they're really funny and a good time. And y'all should follow them. But let's get started with the haul. I haven't even unboxed this. I did unbox the candle box because I needed it to ship something, but I haven't unboxed them. But these are actually all repeats, nothing new to me, but I do recommend these ones. Um, I think most of all, every one of them is $12.95 or $12.25 right now um, at SAS. This is the Iced Blueberry Biscotti. I love the packaging. I don't like the, the matte finish because it's like nails on a chalkboard. It is sugared blueberries, sweet vanilla icing, almond biscotti, and brown sugar. And it's good. It's it, You know what it smells like? Most people don't have this candle, but... If you have the French baguette candle from Bath & Body Works, which I know a lot of people hate, but I love, but I hate suntan candle. So everybody likes their own things. But this smells like that with blueberry. It really does. It's really good. I feel like this is bakery without being like too bakery. Like if you're just getting into it, I really suggest this candle. I went from hating bakery scents. I always thought, why am I going to make my house like smell like something that I can't offer my guests or my husband or myself? Like if it's going to smell like strawberry pound cake, then I better have strawberry pound cake. But now it's, I think gourmand bakery is my favorite, which is so strange to say, because I, how long have I been shopping at Bath and Body Works since 2000? 2000 since 2000 oh my goodness i'm getting old it's 21 years and i did not like it until like a year and a half ago the next is one of my holy grail candles that i know they're gonna get rid of so i'm trying to hoard as many as i can this is spiced vanilla cupcake and this is one of the best candles i've ever smelled in my entire life regardless of the beautiful like rosy gold lid and right here it's, I just love it. Um, spice vanilla frosting, fluffy angel food cake, and cinnamon sugar. Oh my goodness, you guys, it is so good. It is so good. It, this could be burnt all year round. It's actually probably going to be perfect for the fall. And it reminds me a lot of the cinnamon spiced vanilla from White Barn, which is one of their core ones that, um, Joyful Candle told me about. But this one I think is even sweeter than that. And I just can't get enough of this. I I wonder how many I have. Okay, I'm going to do a contest and count how many of these I have and count how many of the raspberry jam donut shower gels I have. Because it's, it's embarrassing. I don't even want to talk about it. Oh, this is another um, uh, spiced vanilla cupcake. Did I say spin cinnamon spiced vanilla cupcake? Spiced vanilla cupcake. So good highly recommend and then this one is another favorite of mine probably this one berry waffle and spiced vanilla cupcake are probably my three favorites this one is sweet rosemary vanilla this is i think my fifth or sixth backup first of all look at the the um wax is a beautiful like bluish green turquoise color and the scent notes on this are Fresh rosemary, sweet vanilla cake, and whipped frosting. It is one of the most unique candles that I've ever smelled and one of the best candles. So it has rosemary in it and it has vanilla. And if you like things mixed, um, like pink lilac and vanilla, um, uh, sweet rosemary and vanilla, anything like fruit and vanilla or citrus and vanilla, 
If you like like the margarita cupcake, anything like that, you'll really like this one. I was talking to Love, comma, Amber. She has a YouTube channel and she I am not like as Victoria's Secret as she. I like grab a couple things, but she is like, you should see her closet tour. She is like the ultimate Victoria's Secret pink person in the whole world. It's Love, comma, Amber on YouTube. She's so sweet and so like has a calming voice and I'm so loud that sometimes it's nice just to watch somebody who's not like as loud as I am. It's so good. I highly recommend this one. I'm going to do a top candles of the SAS that I think people should get because not everybody, like my sister will get like five candles every couple months and she'll be like what do you recommend and then we go from there not everybody's as crazy as me i have to realize that sometimes i will go over like scent notes and i'll be like you guys know but you guys might not know okay and now i'm gonna unbox i'm not gonna lift the box because it has my address on it and from what i'm told that is dangerous okay okay I already see like a pamphlet that makes you think that it's a coupon, but we all know it's not. It's just a waste of money of Midsummer Night Dream, which already came out. We don't care about. Put a coupon on this. Back in the day, they had coupons on everything. And it when you went to the SAS sale, they put like a bounce back coupon in your in every single bag. So even if you bought one thing, they had a bounce back coupon. It's crazy. Okay. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize I did this. This is embarrassing, you guys. Okay, another raspberry jam donut shower gel. This I paid more for because I didn't know that it was going to be 75% off. So this was um, $5.40. I know, guys. I know. And then the next, I actually don't have Bonfire Bath Shower Gel. I'm going to try it, but... I love the spray even more than the body cream. I don't know how I'll feel about the shower gel. That's that. A backup of the, ooh, it's got something on it. A backup of the Wellness Collection Avocado Extract. Um, I will do a review on this Wellness Collection line. I'm just gonna give you a sneak peek and tell you that it's like the best. So good, love it so much. This is a holy grail item for me. Um, I am kind of glad it's not an SAS and I know some people were disappointed, but to me, SAS means they're getting rid of it. Hence 30 raspberry jam donut shower gels, but I think that they will be expanding the wellness collection and I feel like it's going to be more of a permanent thing. Don't quote me, but I am part of Bath and Body Works, my two cents, which is kind of like Bath and Body Works sends me, um, like re things to review and things that they have an idea of doing and it seems like they're going to be introducing a lot more um like wellness like uh not as like some sense more hypoallergenic type things and i think this is the beginning of that and so i love 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 this highly recommend highly recommend this and the coconut oil and the pomegranate and the blueberry extract this is Beach Cabana, which is funny because everybody was like, oh my gosh, this is so good. And then I realized I have it from last year and I just think it's okay. Because I went into my bathroom and I went to wash my hands and I was like, Beach Cabana. I just ordered Beach Cabana. But you know what's interesting about this? I, I don't know if any of my hand soaps say White Barn on it. But this one says White Barn instead of Bath and Body Works and... I do kind of like that it's more simplistic than a lot of the other ones. Don't get me wrong. I love like the intricate ones. But this for my bathroom, I think is kind of like soothing looking. Perfect for guests. Most things like this I put in the guest room and most things like uh, what's shaken or like uh, can't stop belief in, you know, the orange swirl. All those cute ones I put in my bathroom. Okay. Last but not least, I'm getting chatty over here. Poor um, Kathy, whoever's name's Kathy or Karen, like chatty Kathy or you're Karen if you're like grumpy, feel bad for them. What is Jessica? Probably something bad, but 
but that's okay. This luminary I had to get. I just thought it was so cute. It's kind of like a metal. It has a pretty champagne gold interior. This was $18.95, but thanks to Cups and Candles, I always want to call them cupcakes and candles, and I obviously love cupcakes, so that's why I think I'm doing that. Um, $15.16. It's a coastal luminary, and it is like a um, seashell. I forgot what these are called. So pretty. Let me put the candle and see what it does. Okay, so it's perfectly flat. That's the only bad thing is make sure you wait till it cools down to take it out because it's perfectly flat. So once it's in there, you have to tilt it to take it out. But burning, I'm gonna try to find one with like more, ooh, a candle that's more clear so that I can see what it looks like burning. Look at that, it's so pretty. You guys, this is highly recommend. And if black isn't your thing, which m the only black is the mid-century modern vibe that I have, sorry for my dogs, that I have in my husband's man cave, I may spray paint this with like a taupey color, but stay tuned, we'll see. But highly recommend this one. I think it's a perfect neutral and perfect for all year long because it doesn't stand out as like beachy. They are going crazy. Maybe this is a Bath and Body Works order. Anyway, thanks y'all so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys. Okay, I'm back because the first um, UPS came and dropped off some like Amazon beach chairs I got. And then there was a uh, minivan that pulls up and it's laser ship and they drop off the Bath and Body Works. So I'm gonna unbox this one too. What timing that is. Talk about perfect timing. Um, This is probably the order that I did on the, I don't know what this is. Okay. This, this, oh, this is the, okay, so the confetti cake pop in the body cream, the margarita cupcake in the body cream. Ooh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited about these. And the, another margarita cupcake. So I have three of these now. I'm going to keep one in my car, I think. And then the only other thing. I'm trying to buy most things in store because it's generally cheaper. But this is an online exclusive. Come on, come on. And this is the coconut culotta that I got in the, um, in the one wick. But... It is coconut rum, crushed pineapple, and sweet vanilla cream, which is like right up my alley. This smells kind of like the coconut pineapple spray that was just in my last video that I'm wearing the same clothes. So obviously y'all know I just did that video like 30 minutes ago. But yeah, it smells like a pina colada. Only a little bit less pineapple and more like... Um, like coconut water. Wow, that's good. The one wick was really good. It seemed light, but I put it in my bathroom and my whole bathroom and hallway was filled with it. So I love the packaging too. Anyway, that worked out perfectly. Thank you all so much for watching. Come back for more videos. I have to stop buying because my favorite, this isn't even my favorite season. My favorite season is fall and winter. So I'm not sure what I'm doing here, but stay tuned for more videos. I do crafts, beauty, fashion. I test out things. I review some of the candles, some of the body care. So stay tuned, keep watching, and have a wonderful day. Thank you all so much for watching. See you on the next one. Bye, guys.